Hey guys, it's my, uh, it's my snow dog build. Um, it was kind of an early winter project. I wanted to show you guys kind of how I build it and uh, what I bought for it and a couple of mistakes. Um, this ended up being a late, I don't know, late 90s Polaris Indy chassis. Um, it worked out great. Uh, aluminum tunnel, has a couple bogeys, which is what I've been reading pretty good for these things. Um, the frame, I pretty much went with a 1x1 one one 065. Um, wanted to go the lightest I could just to keep this thing um, pretty manageable. Um, I went with a Harbor Freight engine and uh, and the video you see it running, it started two poles. Um, it's got to be negative five here. So that was really impressive. Um, this is just a knockoff Comet. Uh, Tav 230 series or something like that. And then uh, I went with the biggest sprocket you could fit um, without touching the track. I guess, I don't know if you guys can see that. And then um, I just kind of fabbed up something to tension the chain. Um, I didn't have something on there before and it would kind of slip and you'd tighten it up and then it just keep kind of getting in slack. So uh, I put that tensioner on there um, went with a 120 inch cable. My first cable was too short, had to order another one. Um, and then kinda made it, made this fold over um, so you could kinda carry it in the back of the truck a little easier. Um, one update I did was put these carriage bolts for that to rest on and then I kinda just jam nutted them on there for adjustable height if you wanted to sit and or uh, stand, which I prefer standing. And then I just made this hitch out of uh, just a bracket I had laying around in a heavy duty door hinge. Um, this thing's really impressive. I, uh, we had it out on the lake, what was that? Three weeks ago and um, we were towing probably a thousand pounds. Um, and uh, we did that, trekked all of our gear out, and uh, only, uh, we blew one belt, so it kind of strained us, but other than that, it was awesome. Towed all of our gear out, got lots of compliments. A couple guys wanted to buy it almost on the spot. Um, but yeah, I mean, you saw the video I was um, going through. It's gotta be, I don't know, 15 inches of snow right now. Um, and it trucks through it just fine, but it's definitely a lot slower. If you've got a few inches on the ground, I was probably going, I don't know, 15, I'd say. But uh, yeah, I definitely recommend building it. I think I probably only got $300 in it right now. Um, and I got the sled for free, so that does help. Um, I, you know, but I think everybody knows a guy that's got it broke down so will be a lot back, at least me personally, I do, so. Yeah, if you guys want to see any more videos of it, I'll try to try to upload them. Um, you can just leave them in the comments. But uh, and I would have loved to kind of take you guys through the build process, but uh, I kind of just this would be my first video on YouTube, and uh, this is kind of where it lies. Um, there's going to be a lot more uh, videos coming up, just on different projects. I I tinker a lot in the garage, hunting and fishing wise. Um, probably going to be adding this build video it kind of it's too bad i'm about halfway through it um but i just have to fix up one little mistake that i had um i had to take the head off again and that'll be another video but uh yeah if you guys want to see any more of this um or how i built it definitely please uh comment or message me i'm still trying to figure out youtube so um it'll be kind of a slow process for me i'm a very 27 years old, but super computer illiterate, so.